Hello YouTube, I hope you enjoyed my last tutorial. So today we're going to be talking about After Effects and this cache. Because I noticed whenever I use After Effects, all my preview files and rendered files, they store in a particular location on my hard drive, which consumes a lot of space. So it is ideal for you uh, as a designer or a creative to always clear your After Effects disk cache. So today I'm going to show you how to clear your After Effects disk cache after every use. So let's get it started. Go to edit, not files, preferences, media and this catch. Catch it all. Some people call it, I call it, I call it catch most of the time. But. So um, you just come here where you see enable this cache. Eh? So you, it's always checked. Sometimes some people actually allocate um, a separate disk, like an external drive that the users catch it. So I'm going to just click this button and you see how it frees up space on my computer. Click this up then you can see um are you sure you want to delete two 20 gigabytes can you see it actually took over 20 gigabytes 20.3 gigabytes from my hard drive so which is which is weird so i'm just gonna click ok and it's gonna delete that then also i also clean up this one as well which is um the cache um database and cache so i'm just click this just clean it up then I'll click OK. And I'm done. So I'll close After Effects. Then I'll, ba I'll be back here. Fresh. You can see now we have um, um, we gained uh, we have the three gig free. Before we had sixteen. Now uh, was it sixteen or fifteen? So that's um how to clean up your used up space on Windows. So you can also do the same thing on um on your Mac OS. It's still the same process. Just go to Edit, Preferences, Media and Disk Cache, and you click Empty Disk Cache. So after every project, always make sure you do that, like to be on the um, to have a more free space and to be on the safer side because you wouldn't want a situation whereby your computer will crash because um you didn't know your disk was filled up. So um thanks for watching and if you find this tutorial useful. Um, don't forget to subscribe. Um, if you have any other suggestion, don't forget to drop in the comment section. And if you have a tutorial that you feel you want me to work on, just drop it in the comment section. Bye. Take care of yourself. And um, okay, I forgot. Don't forget to give me a thumbs up on this video. <laughs> yeah, that's what keeps me going for making more videos, by the way. Yeah. Um, I'll see you in the next video.